American actor and comedian Robin Williams has been found dead at his California home in a suspected suicide. He was 63. Williams had suffered from bouts of depression and had struggled with drug abuse and alcoholism. Hollywood has been shocked at the death of one of the most inventive comedians of his time. Williams earned his sole Oscar for his role as a fatherly therapist in the 1997 drama Good Will Hunting. You? See, I didn't have the heart to tell. <laughs> oh, God. Did she woke herself up? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Christ. Ah, but, Will, she's been dead two years, and that's the shit I remember. You see? You have a barbarian in you, after all. Now, you don't get away that easy. Picture of Uncle Walt up there. What does he remind you of? Don't think. Answer. Go on. A, a, a madman. What kind of madman? Well, think about it. Just answer again. A crazy man. No, oh, you can do better than that. Free up your mind. Use your imagination. Say the first thing that pops into your head, even if it's total gibberish. Go on. Uh, uh, Adrian Cronauer was sent to do the impossible. I was sent here on very strict orders from a colonel. What the hell's going on here? His mission? To build morale. Where are you from? Off of uh, Cleveland, man. Obviously, Vietnam's not that much of a change. Williams will appear in the upcoming film, Night at the Museum, playing the statue of American politician Teddy Roosevelt, who comes alive at night. Sir Lancelot, at your service. Theodore Roosevelt, President of the United States of America. I have no idea what that means. All my life, I've been plagued, as most tigers are, by this existential quandary. Why am I here? And now that I'm dead, I'm a ghost, it's why aren't I gone?